This is the Gladel 1500 watt portable electric heater. Let's take it out of the box. In the box you get the user manual and the heater itself of course. It's blue just as you see it here. It has a standard polarized US plug on it right there and there are two controls. Thermostat and you have the main control which is off, fan, low, or high. High is 1500 watts, low is 900 watts, and the fan is whatever wattage it needs to use. It is a ceramic heater, as you see. That's the element there. It doesn't glow or do anything special like that. But it does heat up very quickly. You should see heat coming out of this within approximately three seconds of turning it on. So let me get it plugged in and we'll give it a test. When you turn the unit on, I've put it on fan. There is a red light here and the fan is also thermostatically controlled. So if I turn it on, it comes on and certainly seems to blow a nice amount of air out. So the airflow on it is quite good as well. You can, of course, use it in this mode if you just want a fan, and for uh, something close up like this, it certainly will work just fine. So I'll put it over to low, and it certainly is warming up. I definitely do feel warm air coming out. going to be about 111, 114, 116, 125, 140 something. Very nice and warm now and that's just on low. I'll move it over to high. And indeed it has gotten considerably warmer than it was before. 207 I got. But we're looking around 180, well there's 200. About 200 and change. It certainly is belting out the heat pretty nicely. Feeling it all the way back here about, oh, three and a half feet away. And of course you can adjust that with the thermostat. If it's turned down to a point where it's not necessary, then it will shut off and wait until the room is cold enough to trigger the thermostat and turn it back on. The back of the heater is just a big fan grill like that. And also I want to show you on the bottom is a tip over switch. Here's the information tag right over here. But the tip over switch is there so in case it does get knocked over it won't start a fire. And it's got a nice foot on it, if you will, like that. So that way, even if the surface is a little uneven, it'll still press it. And it's very springy, but clicks early on. So it'll conform to most surfaces without any problem. Some other heaters have a very small uh, little switch on them. And uh, it makes it difficult if the surface isn't completely flat. But this one... It makes no difference because it works just fine with that nice big foot on there. It also, of course, has overheat protection on it. In the event it does overheat, for some reason, it will shut itself down to avoid a potential problem. And it's fairly quiet operation at under 50 decibels. So not a bad little heater, nice and portable. The blue is a very nice color as well. That's the color it comes in, and all around makes for a nice heater for a room. If you'd like to purchase this item, I'll leave a link in the video description where you can find it available for sale on Amazon. Thanks for watching. Make sure you click like, make sure you click subscribe, and take care. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.